a 1970 shovel head, battery cases. It has been put in a early jammer frame, so I believe. No factory number on the early jammer frame. They were not required to give numbers. There's little telltale signs of how it was made. So I have no proof other than the fact I know what they look like. Now back in the day when this bike was built, this FLH style rigid frame was the shit. It's as cool as the most coolest bobber today at the time. And they were impossible to get. You just couldn't get them. I was literally fronted $10,000 by a guy to go find him one. I drove across the country looking and I couldn't find one back in 96. Just unobtaining him. So it has not run for at least a year. The shifter paws in the transmission are broken. They need to be replaced. It's going to need a battery and a good tune up. Got good numbers. Beautiful motor mounts. And somebody took a set of stamps and put in the matching numbers here on the frame. SNS carb. Nice little bike. Like I said, when this bike was built, this was all the rage. This was the shit. So, kick an electric start, but uh, shifter paws are definitely out in the transmission. So, that's the little springs that go in here. They need to be replaced. So, you know, it is for sale. If you're interested, send me an email, huntingharleys at gmail.com, and we'll see you guys on the next one. Bye bye.